Hey guys, it's Brian from Connected Home, coming to you today from beautiful Ocean Isle Beach where we are working on a crazy retrofit. This is a very large property, a lot of stuff the homeowner wants to add in, so I just wanted to take a minute to show you guys, sometimes it can be a little bit crazy in the middle of surgery. They always tell you when you walk in on it and you see stuff all over the bed, don't freak out, it'll all get put back together. Same way here with all the wiring. Check out our structure panel box and all of the wiring that is coming back to it from all over the house. We are running lighting control here, so a lot of the light switches are going to have wires coming right back to this box so we can program scene controls for them. Also running some new TVs, running some sound speakers in some of the rooms as well as some of the bathrooms. We've got a TV and screen going in outside as well too, plus we need to make sure we have sound out the, uh, back for that. So we do have a lot of wires we're working with, but not too terribly complicated when you have technicians that really know what they're doing. Give me one second and I'm going to explain why. <laughs> All right, guys, I know this looks like a little bit of a mess. There are a lot of wires coming through here, but remember, this is the rough end phase. A couple of things that'll save you some time on the back side of the job, make sure you color coordinate all of your wires. Another tip is make sure you label all of your wires ahead of time. All of our guys take the extra time to make sure they go through, label each wire, what room it's going into, as well as what panel or what function it serves. Notice all the electrical tape on the very end of all of these. These are room by room runs that all of our guys pull through at the same time. Now the tape, yes, does make it a bit easier to actually pull through the wall, keeping all the wires grouped, but also keeps them grouped together for later on when we actually put it back into the structured wiring panel. These are the ends, a little bit of long run, so we will cut some excess. We're running home lighting over here, a little bit of automated lighting, so we definitely need some extra wires to run back to the panel for that. Plus we have a couple of new TV locations. We're running some speaker wire as well as home security. So there is a lot of wires over here. Always makes it a lot easier if you take the time to label and color coordinate. All right guys, now we're back at the panel for one last time. Now, I know this can look a bit daunting, a bit overwhelming. Just keep in mind, all of our technicians are CDA trained. They're very professional, been doing this for a long time, as you can tell by how they pull their wires. Once this is completed, a couple of weeks, maybe a month, I'll be able to come back and show you how beautiful and how artistic this box can actually look once completed properly too. Because if you think our guys are good just by doing the little pre-work over here to save us on the backside, wait until you actually see the final product. Guys, Brian from Connected Home once again. I want to thank y'all very much for taking the time to watch this video. If you have any questions, want to check us out, see if we can help you with any solutions at your home, connectedhomenc.com, or give us a call, 910-317-0876. Thank you very much, guys, and see you next time.